okay, so what we're going to do is take this YouTube and disable it. So I just long press on it, disable. Now I will go to a website called vanst.me, as you can see. So you type on your search bar vanst.me and you land on this page. And you have to install Revanced Manager here. Downloading, file downloading. Okay, open. Package installer. For security, your phone currently isn't allowed to install an on app from the source. You can change this in setting. Okay, so allow permission. Now, do you want to install this app? Yes. App installed, okay, done. And um, I put this on my home screen page. Okay, now we open. Now, okay, to install, um, so that's the Revance Manager. What you just saw is the Revance Manager, okay? What you have to do to make YouTube uh, work for free without ads and with lots of additional features like sponsor block and return YouTube dislikes, for example. Uh, so first thing is not to download YouTube Revance and, uh, re and Revance YouTube Music, but micro G, that's the first thing you have to do. Downloading for your security, your phone currently isn't allowed to install an app from this source. It's normal because it's um, it's not coming from uh, Google Play. So then it's asking me, do you want to install this app? Yes, install. Okay, so now um, I've waited uh, like um, thirty seconds, and it said. Uh, it was uh, successfully installed. So you have to add Google account. So click here, Google accounts. And uh, before doing this, you you also want to check a low app to find accounts. So when you open YouTube, then uh, it will automatically uh, link your Google account. To YouTube and you don't have to register again and again with your name and account and password uh, for every app. Add Google account, Microsoft services, sign in. And I'm, uh, I'm okay to go. So let's go back to Revance Manager and install here, YouTube Revanced and YouTube uh, Revanced YouTube Music install. Installing. Install. Okay, YouTube Music is, uh, is ready to go. Okay, here do you want to install? Yes. And here you go. So, now. You have YouTube Music and YouTube. It looks like the original YouTube, right? These are the original icons. So you just grab them. I mean, that's what I do, you know. I want them to have on my homepage and YouTube Music and add it to the to your homepage or whatever you want. And um, one thing you have to do before opening also is uh, um, Long press on it and go in information, set as default here. So you click on set as default in this app. You go on supported web addresses and you have to tick all this option, YouTube. That means if someone sends you a YouTube link, uh, it will open automatically in this spoof um, YouTube. Okay. And here, same thing with YouTube music. Goes in its, in its parameter, supported web addresses, 
and ticket. Okay, now you go, you're uh, ready to go. So I want to allow uh, not notifications. Microsoft battery optimizations must be disabled to prevent issues. Disabling battery, okay. So uh, you just want to do what it says, continue. So stop optimizing battery usage, allow. All right, and here, okay, so this is, these are my French recommendations. That's, uh, that's why you don't know these channels. And here, that's YouTube, and know what you can, you can use, I mean, you can uh, type on any video. You see, there's no what's at all. And uh, this, re this revanced apps, and it, it allows you to customize lots of things. So you go to uh, your channel. I mean, you type on your uh, uh, profile picture and then click and you can switch channels. So these are all my other channels, but you can go to settings and these are the regular settings, sort of boring. And But if, if you go to revanced settings, you see the alternative thumbnails, feed, general, shorts and stuff. For example, for uh, for my case, I hate shorts. I don't like them because they are a waste of time, but draining my my day, uh, my uh, my time. So uh, I don't want to 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 have shorts displayed anywhere. So um, I will disable short. I mean, disable resuming short player. Yes, disable sh uh, short background play. Hide shorts in unfit. Hide shorts in search results, hide shorts in subscription subscriptions feed, and hide shorts in watch history. Uh, no, maybe not this one. And um, hide or show. Yeah, I mean, he. So normally, if I go back to the home page and reset, no more shorts. No more shorts, no more annoying shorts. And for YouTube music, same thing. I mean, no sponsor, obviously, but no ads. Here, you can find your uh, your music taste and uh, my playlists are there. Okay, so I hope you you like this video and don't forget here. And uh, one last thing is to al always check up for new versions. So uh, go here and if you see, instead of open, if you see update, you go to uh, update your uh, YouTube reverse because YouTube itself uh, has lots of updates, like every month, uh, almost every two weeks, there's an update on YouTube. So um, the GitHub community is always working on uh, updating the this spoof, this revanced version of YouTube, and uh, sometimes they will uh, offer you updated version of YouTube. And if you don't update from this revanced manager, uh, it's possible that your YouTube revanced app uh, will not uh, work again. So that's it. Uh, so have a great experience. Bye. Good luck.